was playing with the monsters They brought me a light but got no alibi Everything that brought me alive Oh, we're all like monsters Playing with the monsters They brought me alive But got no alibi
Hello! Hello, hello! It is Monday! Now, today was supposed to be Xenoblade, but uh, I just I just wanted a comfort game today. <laughs> what other comfort is there than Mario Party? Am I right? Hello, Blue. Hello, Blama. Hello, hello. Welcome in. Hope you're having a good day. Uh, yeah, the weekend was it was something normal weekend. Um. And today, uh, you know, just lost in thoughts as a chronic overthinker, that's not a good combination. But I'm here to take my mind off of all that, so we're just gonna go say hi to Bowser. <laughs> we're probably gonna land on all the Bowser today. Because, um, yeah, my emotional support Bowser. <laughs> let's go Bowser land. Let's go, let's go, let's go, because, um... Why wouldn't you go to a theme park when you're feeling sad? <laughs> My favorite to a completely comfortable, non-frustrating game. I mean, as someone who plays a lot of Mario Party, uh, as someone who plays a lot of Mario Party, I mean, we had the green team on last time, but hold on, uh... No, 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 I made that mistake before. I made that mistake before of having both script writers on. Uh, we are not doing that again. This will be fine. I think this will be fine. Man, as someone who plays a lot of Mario Party, Mario Party is, like, the comfort game for me. <laughs> I know a lot of other people be like, oh, this, like, chill game, like, oh, a Minecraft, like, you just build stuff. Or like a, a mellow game like Animal Crossing, you know, like games like that are the quote-unquote comfort games. Not I. <laughs> I like to torture myself for comfort. <laughs> anyway. Anyway. <clears throat> anyway, we're about to land. Uh, I know I posted in Discord as well after a uh, Thursday stream. Like, I... Okay, I had just read it out. Uh, the Bowser Land, Bowser, King of Koopas, created the adventure board. Uh, and it's, and all it's fun, yeah, frightening events. Yay. Bowser, Bowser, he is our man. If he can do it, no one can. Ah, Bowser's truly wonderful, wonderfully great. Bowser is a true superstar. Even if you can complex. <laughs> My my brain is moving faster than my mouth <laughs> right now. <laughs> Even if you collect a million stars, you'll never defeat Bowser. Never, ever, ever. Never, ever, never gonna let you go. Anyway, um, I'd say Baby Bowser fan of God 7. Um, but you can try if you like. Good luck finding your kidnapped buddy Toad. Well, must decide turn order to begin this impossible quest. Not surprised, I'm going third. <laughs> I have gone first once and it was a total anomaly. And it continues to be an anomaly. Um, but yeah, after Thursday's stream, I had just read it out. I had left the room for like two minutes to go to the bathroom. And I come back to Riley trying to go to Bowserland and she rolls and she would go first in the turn order. Like, child, you have better luck than I do, and she's three! <laughs> so that was really fun. Rolled a three for third? Coincidence? <gasps> and I have a three-year-old who is a three-nager? <gasps> like, yeah, the, the three-nager stage is hitting so hard <laughs> right now. Because they say, you know, terrible twos. They That's when they get, like, the attitude. That's when um, they don't want to do anything. That's when, um, you know, that's when, you know, the shit hits the fan. Um, it didn't quite do that with Riley when she was two until, like, a month before she turned three. And threes are worse than two. At least in my experience. <laughs> so, but yeah. Everything's coming up three. 
Um, as soon as my air conditioner shuts off, I am going to turn it off because it wasn't too bad in here, um, right when I got started. Um, but I wanted to kind of cool it down a little bit, get some air flowing in here. Um, now here's the thing with Bowserland. Everything is backwards. The banks are backwards. Welcome to Bowser Bank. You have been pre-approved for a five-coin loan. By the way, principal and interest will come to 10 coins. Invest wisely. So the banks are the opposite. Instead of depositing coins into the bank as you pass them, you are given a loan. And if you land on the bank, you have to pay back that loan. Ugh! This is how we start! I don't want it. I don't want it. I've also seen once it, this did happen on stream one time too. Um, if you, if the coin total for the loan is really, really high and you don't have enough coins, but you have a star, the bank will take your star. <laughs> that was insane. Keep the three game going, set it to 33. That'd be really cold, though. Because it's supposed to be a high of, like... Last time I had checked the weather, it was supposed to be, like, a high of 91. I think at least the last time I had checked the weather. And that was, uh, like, at 7.30 this morning. Yeah, I ain't... I ain't beating him. Nope. I survived, but I ain't beating him. <laughs> uh, but yeah. Crazy stuff happens. The 91 freedom degrees. Yes. Freedom units. As I've heard it called. 91 degrees Fahrenheit. That's at least the last time I had checked. The weather. At like 7.30 this morning. Because... Let me see... Currently checking the weather. I use AccuWeather. I didn't always. I used WeatherBug and I hated WeatherBug because it was so inaccurate. <laughs> and then my husband started using AccuWeather. And uh, got me to do it, finally. Um, and that's probably the most accurate. At least for us. And right now it is telling me it is 84 degrees Fahrenheit outside right now. So that's exciting and fun. What's up? Battle minigame, 10 coins. 35. Uh, boop. Let's see. Yep, the high for today is still 91. But we do have a uh, fire weather watch. I'd say. Yep, fire weather watch, which is essentially uh, no, no moisture in the air. And it's really hot and windy. That's usually the combination for fires around here, because we get them sometime. Um, there was even a fire, like, 20 miles north of us uh, a month ago-ish. And, whew, it was something. Fire Weather Watch probably has nothing to do with Bowser. Nope, not at all. Not at all. Alright, boop. Whoa, didn't want that. There we go. Uh. Is that it? Was that all that moved? I think that was all that moved. Alright, I'm gonna leave it alone. My air kicked off, and I'll be right back real quick. I'm not even muting my mic to do this. There we go. And ta da! Ugh! And ta-da, sit back down, untangle my headphones, <laughs> probably the stash, it's probably the stash. There we go. What I got first? With a 98, let's go. Woo woo, woo woo woo. <laughs> All of uh, Zack Ryder slash Matt Cardona. All right, so um, for like the weeks leading up to WrestleMania, uh, I 
need to go up and around if I want the star, so we're gonna run it back. Another battle mini game. Let's go. Um. Uh, there's been a TNA wrestler that has been going viral in the wrestling community for whatever reason. <laughs> um. His his uh <clears throat> say his name. And he appears. I believe in Joe Hendry. Uh, yeah, TNA wrestler by the name of Joe Hendry has been... His theme has been going viral on, like, the wrestling community. And it's been crazy. It's like, oh my god, we would pop so hard if we heard this. Ha <laughs> ha! Minimal movements, let's go. Say his name and he appears. I believe in Joe Hendry. I believe in Joe Hendry. Oh my god, the theme is so good though. Like, I didn't even know who Joe Hendry was until I've been hearing it all over the place. Like, TikTok, Twitter, like everything. It's been crazy. It has been crazy. Do 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 Toad Bandstand, let's go. I'm still, I still can't believe the events of WrestleMania, cause fans of WWE. Um, also since I saw Royal Blue in chat with the first earlier, I will say, um, I know her wedding was like that same weekend as WrestleMania, and um, I I would have been willing to give up. WrestleMania for blue. <laughs> like, I, I'm serious, but like, a lot of things in life kind of stopped us from going to the wedding because we were invited. I would have loved to go, but life happened. And also, my husband ended up having to work that Saturday, so yeah, I couldn't have ended up going anyway. But we did get them a gift. We did get them a gift. I appreciate how Japanese baseball sometimes has all the players enter on a zipline wrestling style. Oh, I love that. <laughs> I love that. What? What do you mean they won? Mario tanked it. Mario sandbagged me. Mario sandbagged me. 100%. I will accept no other truths. That is my truth is Mario sandbagged me because I wouldn't put it past him. <laughs> but also just kind of trying to get everything flow into like a quote-unquote new normal around my household because um, events that have happened over like the last month. So, you're supposed to rescue the princess, not fail at drums. <laughs> I know, I'm sorry. Maybe the drums aren't meant for Peach, or maybe Peach did everything right and Mario was... Oh yeah, Mario's supposed to rescue the princess. Duh. Hey, what's up, Bowser? Um, hey, Bowser. I'm feeling a little sad right now. Do you think I can get a hug from you? I think you would give the best hugs, honestly. Um, 100 Star Present doesn't sound too bad. Or Chance Time, that... Sure. 100 star present, chance time, same thing, right? 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 Lucky game, chance time. Oh shit! Oh shit! <laughs> you don't have enough coins, we'll have to get by with what coins you've got. I'm such a nice guy. Oh, Bowser, you're the nicest. You're just the sweetest. <laughs> Don't worry, Bowser. I'll get my coins back one way or another. <gasps> oh my goodness. You know I'm not mad because it's Luigi. <laughs> Luigi rocking the ones for a second. <laughs> Say his name and he appears. I believe in Joe Hen- It's stuck in my head now. I can't get it out. Carry all those noisy coins around. Nope, nope, not. They're not gonna weigh down my pockets. I feel lighter, you know? I feel light as a feather. I don't need money weighing me down. Nope, I don't want that problem. I mean, honestly, that's a good problem to have is money in your pocket weighing you down. Because then you'd have money.
left in, right, left in, right, left in, right, rip it, rip it. <laughs> Just singing all the songs today. You know what? This is fine. Let's go. Fourth place. Oh, I've I've come I've crawled out of worse. You know what my biggest flex is? I have crawled out of a draw 24 in Uno before. If that was a star, I would have been angry at that one. Pixel, pixel perfect. Thwomp dodge? I, I mean, I, I wasn't complaining. I won't complain about that because I usually get squished. <laughs> Um, uh, my brain was gonna go somewhere and I forgot. Uh, view map. Where is, uh, okay, so Luigi's gonna get hit no matter what. I can hit Wario if I really wanted to. But also, I would have to get whacked too. I can't afford the star right now, so screw it. I'm going to change the parade route. Screw it, because it's Bowser Land. It's the happiest place on Earth, and I want an item, maybe. Because it's the slot machine. <laughs> it's the slot machine. Oh, I didn't. Um, three of a kind. There you go. Okay. Oops. <laughs> I, I I jumped the gun a little bit. I got a little jittery, but that's okay. Because, you know, I'm just here to have fun. I'm just here to have fun. And Luigi, why would you do that? You could have avoided it entirely. You could have avoided the parade entirely. But no, you chose... You chose this path. You chose this path, and, uh, you shall... You shall reap what you sow in a little bit. Yeah. Alright. Uh, oh yeah, I'm um, just kind of working things into a new normal. Uh, in, in life right now. Wow, why, how, what? Okay, there we go. Yeah, things have kind of changed a little bit in like the last uh, month. <laughs> um, it's been cr pretty crazy. Where are we going? Where did you come from? Where did you go? Where did you come from, Cotton Eye Joe? Luigi, please. Go. Torpedo, go. Uh, nice. I wanted to hit them. Dang it. Oh, come on. <gasps> Luigi, please! Luigi, please! Go, go, go! Nice! <laughs> Saw that one coming. <laughs> um... And, uh, the new normal is, uh, gonna be an adjustment. The new normal is definitely gonna be an adjustment. But, um... It'll be okay, hopefully. <laughs> hopefully. The only thing that doesn't change is change always changes. That is true. Wise words. Uh, thanks for waiting, everyone. Uh, without further delay, let the Bowser par the Bowser parade, the Bowser parade. Oh, look at that! I want to be a part of the parade. I mean, I've been a part of parades throughout my life. Um. Like, countless, you know, hometown parades, like the Homecoming Parade, like there's a Christmas Parade I've been a part of a, a few years with, like, uh, the little kids uh, dance um, when I was a child. Um, and there was always, there was a high school dance that we um, got to be part of the, um, uh, part of the... Like part of the parade, we did like a dance to like a Christmas song, um, so that was fun. And also, you know, homecoming parades, um, the the big parades on Main Street, cause small town. Um, big parades on Main Street 
uh, were always during the fall. And I uh, golfed in the fall, so uh, for our, you know, parade. Um... All right, we're blocked for 15. Sure, I'll take it. I'll take it. No! <laughs> I'm like, I don't have anything, buddy. I'm sorry. You're gonna have to cancel that loan. <gasps> Luigi. Nice. Um, but in those uh, homecoming parades, uh, we got to rode on golf carts for our section of the parade. So it was really fun. I golf, but only in the fall. Just because around the corner. <laughs> yeah, I, I haven't been golfing in seven years. Because uh, I haven't been golfing since I broke my wrist, and I broke my wrist in 2017. So um, I would love to go golfing again, but also I have no time, really. And if I were to go golfing, I don't want to lug a three-year-old around, so... I mean, as much as that is, she is a wild child, she will run off. And um, out on the open golf course, Nah. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. I don't need you and me. Got 180 degrees and I'm coming. Okay. Say his name and he appears. I believe in Joe Hendry. <laughs> Joe Hendry won me the minigame. Thanks, Joe Hendry. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Time for DK strategy. <laughs> Uh, but also another parade I was a part of um, was the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade in New York City uh, in 2012. Uh, I was a senior in high school and uh, that previous summer, summer 2012, um, at our dance camp that we went to, you know, a national thing that they do around, you know, the, the states, um, I had made All-American. Like, All-American Dancer, which was really pretty cool. Um, and there are some perks you can do. And we had some girls make All-American before, but they didn't really do anything with that. Didn't really get a perk from it. And uh, the perks you can get, um, or things you can do after making All-American, was either a dance in the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade, or... Um, go to London for the New Year's Parade. And, um, I was also only 17. I was only 17. And, um, I didn't want to go abroad, so I decided to go to New York. So, that's kind of what led to that decision. And, um, it was really fun. Uh, no. I want to keep my money. Um, yeah, it was really fun going to New York. Uh, stayed there a week. Got to do a whole bunch of cool things. Went to Central Park. Um, rode a boat, uh, to see the Statue of Liberty. Uh, went to the Empire State Building. Uh, that was really fun because, uh, there were like different groups that went during different times of day and luckily enough my group went in the evening and so when we got to the top of the empire state building and looked out it was nighttime so we got to see new york city at night and it was really cool and from the top of the empire state building uh you can see where uh the performances were going to be so uh that was really cool i've got i've got pictures from a top of the empire state building so, it was, uh, it was really fun. We got to see a Broadway play of, uh, Bring It On. That was really fun. Oh. No, 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 no. Ha ha! Oh, I love that. I love that ending. Cinema. Cinema. I loved it. The, the Bowser bomb, the explosion as she as she cheers, love it. Um, we also saw the Rockettes 
perform in the Radio City Music Hall. That was really cool. Um, I think that was essentially it. So, I went to New York for a school trip too, but yours sounds way more fun. <laughs> yeah, it was really fun. And we went like the week of Thanksgiving. Uh, so yeah, it was really fun. And DC, all that jazz, something, something, declaration of the constitution. Yeah, I'd only, um, I haven't really been to many states, cause uh, I am in Kansas, which is like the middle of mainland USA. <laughs> And, uh, yeah, a girl from, like, small town Kansas going to New York City, bruh. <laughs> it was insane. Um, but it was really fun. Alright. Say his name and he appears. I believe in Joe Hendry. I believe in Joe Hendry! Joe Henry, how could you do this to me? Nope, nope, come here. No, 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 no. Nope. Excuse you, I want my gold back. I can't! Wow, Mario, you bitch. Mario ruined it. Mario is so anti Joe Hendry, I'm calling it now. He is so anti Joe Hendry. He does not believe. He does not believe in Joe Hendry. And for that, he must perish. <laughs> We're just gonna make today all about Joe Hendry. And you know what? I am not mad about it. <laughs> I am not mad about it. <laughs> I'm a John Hendry guy. <laughs> yep. Uh, he, he likes a different wrestler. Uh, I don't even know what wrestlers he would like, honestly. I mean, he's a cheat. And my brain is like, oh, Eddie Guerrero. He was, you know, he lies, he cheats, he steals. But like, Eddie Guerrero was just so charming about it though. And he was gone too soon, you know? Uh, that battle minigame also screwed me. <laughs> Please let me land in the circle. Thank you. <laughs> I got another chance. I got another chance. Uh, maybe Cody, not Cody, maybe Mario is, you know, a Roman Reigns kind of guy. Acknowledge your tribal chief. But no, we are Cody people. We are Cody crybabies. Cody finished the story. <laughs> ah, a stretch. There's our question of the day. Uh, what's your comfort game? What is your comfort game? Um, it's not particularly the Mario Party 2, but just Mario Party in general is a good comfort game for me. <sighs> Battletoads? Oh, that's a choice. Oh, that was rough. My nails are really long. I should clip them, but I painted them last week. So, uh, yeah. And that felt really awkward to button mash with my nails like they are. Especially A and B at the same time. No! I beat Mario! I did beat Mario. That's all I care about. I just want to beat Mario. That's it. Yeah, Mario Party is a good uh, comfort game, a good shut my brain off type of game that I can just go about my day, <laughs> you know? Or even like, I was gonna say Mario Kart, but I have gotten angry at Mario Kart before. Uh, I mean, I've also gotten angry at Mario Party, but I play so much of it, it's fine. Um, I mean, like, I there was once upon a time where I... Uh, I needed to win that, too. Can I get another eight? That's a nine. I'm landing on that red space. This is fine. This is fine. I still have another chance. I have another chance at life. Um... 
My mass strategy wouldn't work with any kind of nails, I can't imagine. I mean, they're not like super long. They're like barely past my fingertip, but it's long enough to bother me. I mean, it's satisfying to like tap on things with my nails, but that's really about it. That is really about it, so, um. Um, I probably will clip my nails before too long, honestly. Alright. Woo! Haha! I believe! Ah! <laughs> I believe! Say his name and he appears. I believe in Joe Hendry. Bam! I believe in Joe Hendry. Whoop, whoop. Aha, I juked you. I juked you. Boom shakalaka. You did not get the boom and boom shakalaka. I finally win. I can finally get this damn star. Hello, boo. Hello, hello. Welcome in. Hope you're having a good day. Uh, just going back to like mash strategy. At least like in terms of mashing A and B at the same time. That did feel a little bit awkward. <laughs> Um, but like just smashing, just straight up mashing A, I kind of use the side of my finger so it doesn't, my nail length doesn't really affect that. It does affect where my nail polish chips though. Are you kidding me? No, 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 Mario, please stop it. You don't believe in Joe Hendry. You must be punished, please. Anything. Ugh. Damn it. No! No! I finally got enough coins to buy the damn star! And it's up to luck. It's up to faith. I mean, I believe. I believe in Joe Henry. I believe. I want to be the very best like no one ever was. To catch them is my real test. To train them is my cause. I will travel across the land searching far and wide. Each Pokemon to understand the power that's inside. I would have laughed so hard. But no, that's Mario's creative control right there. That is Mario's creative control. I mean, it's an even 40, so I've at least made my money back. So at least there is that. <clears throat> Technique is literally from my Prey Strategy, guys. I I have the instruction booklet for my Prey 1. Or, like, the little booklet for it. Um, yeah, Peachy. Mario, you're sleeping in the Chain Chomp house tonight. You trying to screw me over? Nah, it ain't working. Not this time. Sorry. Ha <laughs> ha! Suck it! Ha <laughs> ha, and I'm out of here. <laughs> Take my star and leave! <laughs> oh my goodness. Electro, Diglett, Nenoran, Mankey, Venusaur, Rattata, Ferro, Pidgey, Seek King, Jilteon, Dragonite, Gasly, Ponyta, Vaporeon, Polyrath, Butterfree. Catch him, catch him, gotta catch him all. Gotta catch him all. I'll search across the land, look far and wide, release from my hand the power that's inside. Venomoth, Polyrag, Nidorina, Golduck, Ivysaur, Grammar, and Vitriol, Moltres. Kind of remember. At one point in time, when I was in college, I had the entire. Yeah, that's a thing, but you're dumb, but you're maniac. Ping, ping, but I'm gonna get you, maniac. Frankenstein, chum, got a maniac, maniac. Ha ha. At one point in college, I had the entire poker app memorized. Because I had nothing better to do with my life than to memorize the poker app. <laughs> oh, man. I'm, I am wearing a green shirt today, but I'm not wearing my running around circle shirt. So, missed opportunity. Oh, shit! I think it got me on the... On the, the, the follow through. Wario, what are you doing? Wario, what are you doing? Wario, what are you doing? Wario! <laughs> Wario! Yeah, that's a thing. Delayed cause trains and bad Wi Fi. No worries, it's all good. I get it. I totally get it. Bowser Parade? Oh, I'm gonna get caught in that. Oh, well, it's fine. I got a star. It's all good. 
Parade! Yay! Um, I believe um, you lose two coins for each space you pass if you get caught in the Bowser Parade. So if you were closer to the start uh, as the parade, you will not lose as much. I lost everything. I know I did. Yep, 100%. Got an action replay today? Oh, let's go! That's awesome! At least the fun part about having no coins is you can't get stolen from! But nice! Uh, my husband used to have an action replay. Um, I can't remember what exactly he did with it. I have to ask him, but I think I remember him. he had one once. And I've seen lots of lots of videos and stuff with a whole bunch of things that you can do. Um, I mean, back in the day, oh, there it is, there it is. It was just delayed a few turns. Um, I know, you know, back in the day, like mid two thousands, late two thousand, I think late two thousands, uh, YouTube. Um, there were these things called machinima. If anyone knows machinima, I watched a lot of Smash Brothers machinima. And just like the shows they would have and stuff. Yeah, that was uh, really fun. And that's kind of how it like snowballed into like some of the content creators and some of the things I have had on, you know, in my internet life um, have become. So yeah, it's kind of interesting. Why do we get what? <laughs> I'm tired of this reskin bullshit. Leave me alone. Gonna mess with that a bit. I had one as a kid. I'm sure my brother stole it. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, I don't know if my husband still has his. And of the Golden Girls theme song, basically word for word, you walk past the song for a uh, hundred and first time and forever burn into your brain. Yep. There are a lot of songs that um that are just kind of in my mind. And there's like songs I haven't heard in like years and sometimes I can like if it comes up I can sing it perfectly. It's like wow. I remember this Yeah, my memory is either really really good or really really bad um, Like I can remember like 10 minute dance routines and I It took years to memorize my phone number that I got and like right as I had it memorized I changed my phone number. <laughs> right as I had it memorized, I changed my phone number. And uh, it also took me a long time to memorize my social security number. That one took a while. Like, I barely even have my own memorized, let alone, like, my children's. <laughs> I have them written down in my wallet, if anything. Um... <laughs> But, uh, yeah, I, and I know I'm not gonna say it. I'm not gonna say what my social security number is, because, uh, that would be a bad. That would be a terrible bad. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Uh, there are some, you know, anime opening songs, or, like, anime that I haven't thought about in years. Um, I've been seeing, uh, like... Uh, these like tweets and on TikTok about like old things. Um, I, I think I mentioned it the other day. Um, there's this older song that was like a lot of like AMVs. Um, and I'm like, oh my god, I love this song. And it's uh, Juliet. I, I, I love that song. I think you're fine. You really blow my mind. Maybe someday you and me could run away. I just want you to know I want to be your Romeo. Hey, Juliet. Hey, Juliet. Yeah. Love it. I'm the exact opposite tenth digit of pi. I'm your guy. What did my hands do 15 seconds ago? Probably hid the key somewhere incredibly stupid. Oh, I feel that. I feel that. Uh, I once had the, uh, I once had Pi memorized up to the 20th digit. Oh, poor Luigi. Um, only because, um, if my entire math class 
had um, my entire math class had 20 digits of pi memorized, we would have gotten like a pizza party or like extra credit for something. You know, and I cannot tell you. I can tell you 3.14159? That's as far as I get <laughs> anymore without looking it up, you know. But also in my eighth grade math class, which was where this was, um, we had nine people in my class. <laughs> it was a small class. So it was actually pretty easy. Hello, Jared. Hello, hello. Welcome in. Hope you're having a good day. Just working on a few things, including making teams for a CPU Smash character for a tournament. Oh, let's go. Nice. Oh, I had one, four, three, and you're ruining it. Oh, I let go of the button for a minute. Doesn't matter. They always get 24 from me anyway. I had one, four, three. One star, 43 coins. You took straight kids away from me, Wario. How dare you take stray kids away from me? How dare you take Bang Chan, Lino, Changbin, Hyunjin, Han, Felix, Sungmin, and Ian away from me? How dare you? That was a lot easier to rattle off than S Cubes, Junghan, Joshua, Jun, Hoshi, Wuzi, or Wanu, Wuji, uh, shoot, shoot, uh, DK, Mingyu, VA, Sunquan, Vernon, Dino. I mean, there's 13 of them. Rattling them off from oldest to youngest. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, what even is happening? Okay, I'm, okay. Plan. Put to action. Boop. I have booped the snoot. I don't know, and I have a key for it. 17, see? Right there. Have the obvious Mario Bros. team, Princess Bowser and Bowser Jr. Just trying to find another pair to fit. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, I mean, Super Jr., the OG 13 members. Um, let's see, we got Ita, Kichel, uh, Hangen, Yesong, uh, Kagin, Shindong. Sungmin, Unhyuk, uh, Donghae, Shiwon, Kibom, Yoruk, or Yoruk, Kibom, and Kihyun. I mean, Super Junior is like my alt group, so. <sighs> Man, it's just like when you get to like the back half of 17, I'm like, oh no! Like, I remember what year everyone was born. It's just the month order of their birthdays. Here you got, uh, S. Coops, who was born August 13th, 1995. You have Jung Han, who was October 4th, 1995. Joshua, December 30th, 1995. Um... June is June 10th, 96. Hoshi's June 15th. I know that because it's the same as my daughter's. Nice. I mean, I'm literally right there anyway. Oh, he's going for the clock. Uh, Wanu is also easy. Uh, Wanu's is July 17th, 1996. So I am not a full year older than he is. Yeah, no, I wasn't getting that. I, I was lucky enough he managed to drop me once and that was it. Uh, let's see. Uh, Wooji, November 22nd, 96. And I know DK and Vernon have the same birthday, just a couple years apart. Uh, D they're both uh, February 18th. DK's is 97, Vernon's is 98. Uh, let's see, last time I did this uh, Motherland, Ness and Lucas, won the whole thing in Smash 4. Let's go, nice. Uh, let's see, uh, DK, uh, Mingyu, shoot, April something. 
I don't think it's the fourth. Is it the sixth? It's like early April 97. I know that's Mingyu. You'd think I would know like my bias wreckers birthday, but I don't. <laughs> um yeah, his April something. Um 97. Uh the eight is November 97. Um I just know he's a Scorpio, so it's uh first half of November. All characters, you know, one with the solo tournament. Let's go, let's go. And then, you know, Vernon's is also, or Sun Quan is uh, January. Uh, I want to say like mid January. Um, 98. Vernon, February 18th, 98. And uh, Dino. I want to say his is also February, but his is 99. He was born in 99. So, I, le I at least know the years 17 was born. <laughs> I just don't know everyone's birthday off the top of my head. Whee! At least, like, uh, one news is easy to remember for me because it's literally the day before my birthday, just a year later. Like, not even a full year, so. Boop! Boop! Ha-ha! Like that. Yeah, Peachy! Somebody call 911. Shot a fire burning on the dance floor. Whoa! Fire burning, fire burn. I'm just singing everything today. This is perfectly fine. Um. Oh, yeah. Now, Stray Kids, with, you know, eight members, it's a little bit easier <laughs> to remember things. Like, Chan's birthday is October 3rd, 1997. Um, Lino's is October 25th, uh, 1998. Chang Beans is August 11th, 1999. I know that because my cousin's birthday was the same day. Um, Hyun Jeans is uh, March 20th, 2000. Um... Han and Felix are one day apart, which is crazy. Han is the 14th, Felix is the 15th, both born in 2000. Sung means it's also easy to remember because it's my husband's birthday. Uh, September 22nd, uh, but his is in 2000. And IN is February 8th? 7th? I want to say 7th. Not 2001. So Stray Kids are younger than 17. They also debuted in, um, 2018. Good. Good. Suffer. So, yeah. I mean, I know BTS's birthdays and stuff, too. Because that's another group that I, you know, like and knew the birthdays of. Because you got Jin, uh, December 4th, 1992. Uh, Suga, March 9th. Uh, 1993. Um, J-Hope, my bias, February 18th, 1994. Um, you got RM, Ratmon, Rat Monster, whatever you want to call him, Namjoon, um, September 12th, 1994. Uh, then you get Jimin, October 13th, uh, 1995. Um, V, uh, December 30th, 1995, same day as Joshua, so 17, and Jungkook's is September 1st, 1997. So I remember birthdays, people. <laughs> Once you tell me what your birthday is, like, you only really have to tell me, like, two or three times what your birthday is. <laughs> and then I'll, I'll know. But also, like, once I learn a birthday, it's like, oh, my astrology brain kicks in. It's like, oh, you are this sun sign. So some things on the surface level make sense. So, there we go. There we go. <laughs> as much as I would love to pass by Boo, 
what I would want to do from Boo is steal a star, and I can't right now, so... Yeah. Hello, DA! Hello, hello, welcome in! Hope you're having a good day! Alright, Stellar is there behind Mario! <laughs> this is what you get for not believing in Joe Hendry. That's what you get. Say his name and he appears. I believe in Joe Hendry. I believe in Joe Hendry. Anyway. Hello. <laughs> um, man. If I can count how many times I have talked about Joe Hendry today, I... It would be a lot. <laughs> it would be a lot. 100%. You like astrology? I do. I do like astrology. Uh, okay. Pointy. Oh, that's too much. Uh, ear out. Nose up a little bit. Mustache. Straight out? No, it needs to be down a little bit. There we go. Kinda correct. Best I'm gonna get anyway. Yeah, I do like astrology. 92! Better than nothing. Um, <laughs> uh, I do like astrology. I know enough to read a birth chart. Um, I can't like go super in depth on my own. I do have to do a lot of looking up, but like I can kind of get an idea of some things and I know enough to dig for the right placements in someone's birth chart to find dark secrets <laughs> I know enough to do that because I have done that with a friend of mine um, and I have dug up like damn <laughs> that's a lot of dark stuff how am I doing I'm doing okay I'm trying to get my mind off of things oh god my hand got caught in not really my hand my um, watch got caught in my headphones. What am I doing? Oh, it's- why is it always the person in, like, the first slot? Why? It's an, I see it's appeal, but I can't stand someone giving me a personality type and compare me to that. That is fair. That is absolutely fair, and that's usually the- the big, like, quote-unquote, like, misconception about, you know, astrology and stuff. It's like, oh, you're- you're a this, and you are this, and, like, no. There's a lot more to it than just, you are so-and-so sign. Um, I can give you an example using, uh, my own- placements um my uh so there's like your sun sign who you, which is like you know your kind of overall essence that is determined by the day you were born and time you were born sometimes depending on the day um and then there is your moon sign um which is kind of looking at like your emotions and you know kind of how you react to things how you are as a child something you know and then there's your, there's your rising sign which is like your appearance how you appear to other people um those are your quote-unquote big three you know um so i have a cancer sun aries moon and a leo rising i feel like a leo rising makes a lot of sense because leo lion they have like the big ass mane at least the male lions got you know the big ass mane and, um, I have curly orange hair. <laughs> uh, you know, like, I got big curly hair, so. That makes sense. Um, so yeah, there, there's that. Um, but, like, my Aries moon, for example. Um, Mario Party streams are the typical basis around, like, my Aries moon because... Um, Aries are known to be like, you know, quick to get angry. Their emotions are one, two, three, they're they're all over the place, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Um, they're very impulsive. And uh yeah, that's me, even though um my cancer son is more like, you know, super reserved, homebody, which that is also me. 
Um, I do have more cancer placements and stuff. Um, ugh. very reserved homebody. Um, but like my Aries moon pops out a lot more, especially on stream, because the the impulsiveness, uh, the the loud, the loud reactions to things. So, and like, there's, you know, so much more that goes into it. But that's, that's only if you like, if you want to, to dig, if you want to learn about it. Like, I'm not gonna force people to learn about it. I just like talking about it because I, I like learning about it. So, but I'm not one of those where it's like, oh, you're a this, so you are a that. Like, no, that's not how it goes. So. Or it's like, I'm not one of those, or like, I'm more like, it's like, oh, I learned like your birthday, you know, the month and day at the very least. And it's like, oh, this is where your sun sign would be. But like, you don't seem like that at all. So I wonder if there are any other placements in your chart that would bring forth, you know, more to the forefront. Cause there is a, um, uh, a YouTuber that I watch. Um, they give off such strong Sagittarius vibes. <laughs> And, um, their birthday was in, like, Capricorn, you know, territory, essentially. Like, early January, I think, is when their birthday was. And I think there was, like, some information on, like, uh, the year they were born as well. And so, um, I looked up, you know, just kind of get an idea on their placements. Because you can look up a birth chart without, uh, knowing the time. But if you do know the time they were born, it, it's more accurate. Um... So they were, you know, Capricorn, Sun, but like so many placements were Sagittarius. So I'm like, that explains the Sagittarius vibes I was getting. So, but yeah, there's like, there's stuff that makes sense. Um, my husband's another example. Um, he is a Virgo Sun. Um, and there are some Virgo traits that, that show up. I even mentioned it to him, I think last night. Uh, <laughs> Because <laughs> um, he's very kind of ru routine in the sense where um, he's... Okay, so Virgos are known to be picky in a sense. And, like, my husband is, like, not picky with most things. He's picky with, like... Like, not really the strangest things, but, like, the shirts he wears. Like, how he dresses. Like, he's very simple. T-shirt and jeans. That's just who he is. Perfectly fine. Um, but he has, like, specific shirts he wears on specific days. And there's really, like, they're just solid color shirts. The only one that's not really solid color is his quote-unquote Sunday shirt, which is his Kansas City Chiefs shirt. <laughs> so, but he has specific shirts he wears on specific days, and he's just quote-unquote picky about that. And that's really, like, the only thing. Um... There are some Virgo traits that, you know, poke through here and there for him. But, like, he is definitely more his moon sign, which is a Taurus. So, but also, double earth sign. Earth signs are known to be pretty stubborn. Especially Taurus. So. Yeah. Right down left. Right down left, up left. Right down left. Left. Five, six, seven, eight. Left, Z, Z. Left, Z, Z. Up, Z, left. Left, Z, Z. Up, Z, left. Boom, shakalaka. Dance master, hello, hi, how are you doing? Um, but yeah, and like, with astrology, it's like, you gotta want the information to really learn about it. So, and I'm not one to like force feed information. It's like, you know, your sun sign is like, you know, the surface level. Um, your... Shoot, what's the word I'm looking for? Crap. Not really... Why is the word ego popping into my head? No, that's not it. That's not it. It's a different word. Shoot. What's the word I'm looking for? Crap. Five, six, seven, eight. I need food, but I already ate. Dang. 
that that's such a mood. I did eat lunch though. I did have mac and cheese for lunch. I'll probably have mac and cheese again for supper tonight because I did promise my oldest daughter that we would have mac and cheese tonight. <laughs> I did say that. I did tell her that. Um, one, two, four happening. One, two, three, four blue. Uh, take a shot. Land up top. Peach was suddenly overcome by the urge to jump to the pipe. That was the opposite direction where I wanted to go. Uh, I do have some food. I need some nuggets. Let's go. No! Welp. Welp. It's fine. Everything's fine. Thank you for the posture check and the hydrate DA. Thank you, thank you. And the crinkle of my green tea bottle. Yeah, I do have a green shirt on. It's actually um, my dad's old, not old, not old, old. Uh, it's his uh, Green Bay Packer shirt that I believe I got for him for Father's Day in 2019. I want to say. But also, you know, with both parents passing and, you know, looking through all their stuff, trying to decide who gets what. Uh, there was no will, so it was kind of hard to really divide and conquer all the belongings. Um, and uh, we, we just spent, like, you know, an entire week um, kind of going through stuff. Who gets what? Um, I decided I wanted the shirt and uh, the Aaron Rodgers jersey that I gave him from New York, because I bought it in New York. Um... Uh, yeah, I decided I wanted them because I gifted them to him, and I'm like, alright. So. I also have a couple of items that some other family members wanted. And they never, like, they said they wanted it, but they couldn't take it with them for whatever reason. And I'm like, alright, I can hang on to it for them. Oh, thank you! Thank you. Uh, yeah, they didn't want it for whatever reason. And uh, I was like, alright, I can hang on to it for you. Um, and never got contacted um, by them. They never asked about it. They forgot about it. So it's just sitting on my floor. And I'm like, you know what? I would like to hang it up. Maybe. I don't know. It's, uh, it's my mom's, like, it's like a, a mirror that can get hung up on a wall and it's like cut out in the shape of a heart because my mom loved heart-shaped stuff. Her favorite color was purple and she loved anything heart-shaped. So that was like her thing. So my nose is like slightly runny. It's like not enough to warrant me blowing my nose, but it's enough to bother me. <laughs> Anyone else kind of get that sometime? <laughs> like, it's runny, but, like, not runny enough to, like, really blow your nose. Because I would, like, pop my ears if I blew my nose right now. <laughs> Alright, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20? 21, 22, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oh god, I counted one by mistake. Oh no. Okay. Alright, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 21? I may have missed one on the initial pass. Oh no. Oh no. Welp. There we go. Yeah! I did miss one on the initial pass. I thought I did. Because, like, that 20 was not very confident. Alright. Whew. Thank you for your patronage. Just a stray hair. But yeah, I'm wearing... Like, I'm not a Packers fan, 
by any means. Um, I mean, of course I got a soft spot for the Packers because, for one, my dad was a fan of the Packers. And my oldest daughter is a Packers fan because that's the team she picked. And I wonder if it's, if it's because green is her favorite color. And uh, it was my dad's favorite team. I wonder if that kind of played into her picking the Packers. Oh, that's bullshit! That is such bullshit right there. And he's right in front of the other star and he has enough to get it? Oh, that's bullshit. 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 Bull I'm still here. <laughs> bullshit. Anyway. Oh no! Insufficient funds. No green team? Uh, we had green team uh, in Horrorland. We had green team on Horrorland. Yeah. So, we, we had green team recently, just not not today. Doesn't always have to be green team, but... Sometimes they need a break. Ah! <laughs> but yeah, we had uh, Yoshi and Luigi. And I think Mario and Wario. So essentially I just replaced Yoshi with Peach. Because uh, I almost had DK on. I'm like, no, I'm not going to have both Mario and DK on like I did last time. And that would have been bad. So. Um, and again, I keep having Mario because he's a great villain. And it makes for funny moments. I'm all about the moments. <laughs> I'm all about the moments. Maybe it was a good thing I still got stuck in the, uh, in the thing. Because I didn't have to do the Bowser Parade. Look at all those shy guys. Look at those shy guys. Do, 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 do. Um, hmm. Ta-da! Still so mad. Mario got a hidden block star, and now he's gonna buy another one, and now he's gonna take first. Someone needs to do something about it. Potluck! I'll take a potluck. Coin potluck. It's not even there. It's not even there! We need, we need Mario to lose money, not you. You don't even have money, Wario. We needed a potluck. Come on, everyone pitching money. Come on. If only reverse mushrooms existed. Oh, that's just flexing. That's just flexing. He doesn't need to use his mushroom. He's already less than a space away. He's literally right there. He didn't need to flex. He didn't need to use a mushroom. What a joke. What a joke. And it's down there. All right. That's, that's cool. That's cool. So Mars is shut around. Shines. Shines. Signs point to yes. All right. I mean, the MWO uh, is in full force. And he gets five coins back because of course. Because of course he does. At least I don't have enough money. Ah. I am stuck here. Not for long. Yay! Say his name and he appears. I believe in Joe It's just stuck in my head, I'm sorry. It is stuck in my head. Uh, you can't, like, you know, I believe in Joe Hendry. Oh, boo. I don't want to flap. I don't want to flap. There's no flap. No flap. Up, down, up, down. Luigi, what are you doing? Luigi, who paid you? Who paid you off? Who bribed you? Who bribed you to suck? Who did that? Luigi! Luigi, please! 
Why? I don't need this in my life. Luigi, I'm your number one fan. I am your biggest advocate. What are you doing? What are you doing? No, I refuse. I refuse. I refuse. That was awful. It was absolutely awful. Luigi, how could you do this to me? I expect that kind of behavior out of like Mario or Wario. Not from you, Luigi. How could you? How could you? In the game, really? In favor of me losing? Thanks. <laughs> I kid, I kid, I kid. Um, I need to do a thing. I'm like nowhere near though. I am nowhere near anything right now. Um, oh, oh. Oh, 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 it's... Ooh, oh, yes! The game heard my cries. The game heard my plea for help. The game heard my plea for help. And I appreciate it. I'm a mess, 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 mess. I'm a mess in distress, but we're still the best dressed. Fear less, say yes, we don't dress to impress. Ha! Take that, Mario. Take that, Mario. What? Yeah. All right, he's a little ahead of me. One, two, three, one, two. Luigi, uh-oh, he's gonna sweep. He's gonna sweep. I have to stop him. Go! Dang it. Alright, fine. Nope. Smashing at this point. Yeah! I believe in Joe Hendry. I believe in Joe Hendry. <laughs> Alright. There we go. We did it. Hooray. We did it. We did it. We did it. Yeah. <laughs> this is just Tessa Jane the musical right now. Because <laughs> I'm literally just singing every single song that is coming to mind right now at this moment. <laughs> Which is perfectly fine because I love music. You know what? This is fine. Even if it is a big old 50 pot. Never mind. Um, I still would have had enough steel star. So ha <laughs> ha! Plan foiled. Send one Mario Party character into the Shadow Realm. Who would it be and why? Mm, Wario. As much as I would love to say Mario, Mario, it is Mario Party. He is also MWO, the leader of the MWO. And it creates entertainment because all the good shows need a good bad guy, hey. All the good shows need a bad guy. Oh, come on. Oh, shoot. What? Bullshit. Bullshit. I punched him in the front. And he... And I didn't get him. There. Get away from me. But when he punches me, like, near the front, he just gets me. That's stupid. Yeah, I would probably say Wario. Because, like, Mario is just much more of an entertaining villain, in my eyes, in a Mario Party game. So, that's just... That's just me. Oh, there's our question of the day. What is your comfort game? This is mine. Not Mario Party 2, in particular. Um, just Mario Party. You know, it's a nice game. I can just sit down for a few hours and just play. You know? So, just need, just need games like that. Hello! Mario, you don't believe. Say his name and he appears. 
I believe in Joe Hendry. I believe in Joe Hendry. All right. Uh, yeah, Joe Hendry's theme has been all over TikTok and Twitter uh, all last week. Essentially, the week leading up to WrestleMania, for whatever reason, it's it's so good, so good. I believe he's in TNA. I believe he is a TNA talent. And uh, yeah, crazy. Like I didn't even know what bro looked like until I looked it up like two days before WrestleMania. <laughs> like I had zero idea. And Mario, a racing game, nice. Yeah, I just, just love good games to just kind of... Ones that kind of you shut your brain off for a little bit anyway. Eh. Come on, I believe. How? How did that not count? How did that one not count? What? Thank you, Luigi. I about dropped my controller. How in the world? I have... Wow. Again, Mario's just rigging everything. The MWO strikes again. <sighs> run around in circles, run around. There wasn't really any running around. It was just trying to put the boom and boom shaka laka. I'm also running on uh, a little sleep right now. So there's that too. Because uh, I did stay up until about two. I stayed up till two last night only because my husband had to get up at two for work. So again, there's a little, there might be back like, no worries DA, no worries. Thank you for leaving the lurk. Do what you got to do, and thank you for the posh trick and the hydra. Thank you, thank you. Much appreciated. Are you gonna steal my money? You gonna steal my money? Ow. 26! I've mashed with my life! Um, I mean, I did have a thought of like making an MWO, you know, Mario World Order, but like that would be copyright. <laughs> I would infringe on copyright, and I don't want to do that. What's everyone doing? We have, uh, where? Okay, he's there. Um, what turn are we on? We are nowhere near a near a thing. I need to go left. Or <laughs> right. Ah. Left and right. Left and right. Left and right. Rip it, rip it. 17 right here. Bowser. Oh, that's right. We have Bowser on Bowser Land. Look at this. Look at him. Wah ha ha ha. I have been awaiting this moment. Bowser, King of the Koopas. Now you shall understand the meaning of fear. Wah ha ha. I was thinking another reason why I uh, chose to do Mario Party instead of Xenoblade is uh, not only did I do my chronic overthinker stuff, um, my daughter doesn't have her after school program today, so I do need to be done by at least 345 and Mario Party is a lot easier to do that. I and mean, even with the Xenoblade plan, I probably would have been done before then, but you know, that, that also kind of played into it as well. But yeah. I believe in Joe Hendry. All right, let's, let's try to. I legit held my breath. <laughs> I wasn't breathing. <laughs> ah! I'm not gonna win, but I wasn't breathing. 
Uh, there have been times in uh, My Pray Superstars where uh, me and my husband um, played this mini game. I got second. That's nice. Um, we were playing this mini game, and we're both, you know, fairly good button mashers. He is slightly better than me, um, and we're both pretty good. Um, <laughs> there have been times in Mecha Marathon in Superstars where we have gotten the exact same distance, and we've done that twice. That is insane that we have done that. That's like crowning moments of synchronicity right there. Because, I mean, we have our, our moments of synchronicity. Um, there was one time, uh, was it Wednesday? It was Wednesday night. Um, he had to, you know, stay somewhere overnight and, um, you know, called in the evening just to kind of, you know, chat and, you know, talk about stuff, you know, uh, and, um, there was a moment, because I have my phone, I usually have my phone on speaker when I am at home taking a phone call, typically, and, um, there was a moment where I put my hand down on my phone, and I almost hit the end call button. I'm like, whoo, almost? Not really. Didn't hit it. Good. Uh, then, like, a few minutes later, uh, the phone call just drops. <laughs> and, uh, the phone call just drops, and we were both like, oh no! And we tried calling each other back at the exact same time. Ugh, I think we did that maybe once, and then I think... I can't remember who called who back, but we, we got the phone call connected again. And, uh, <laughs> we were laughing, and he was laughing because, uh... It's like, you know how I said, um, I almost ended the call? Well, he did. He, he did. And it was really funny. So that that gave me a good laugh. That was what Wednesday night, I think. Oh no. Okay. Night. Can I get the extra one? Thank you. <laughs> like I needed it. <laughs> like I needed it. Just. <laughs> that was just really funny. Woo. Wahoo. Let's go. Yeah, Peachy! Let's go! Um... Oh yeah, Wario got it. That's right. It's over. Oh, boo! That's... Rude. Oh, uh, what you got for me? Mushroom for 12? You know what, I'll take it. It's not too bad. What's two extra coins for a mushroom? Really? And also, I got some money back, so really, I gotta steal seven coins for a mushroom that normally costs ten. Boom, shaka, laka, saving! <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's not really how saving money works, but that's, you know, it's whatever. I swear, if it gave me Rainbow Run again, if it gave me Rainbow Run again. I mean, I have nothing against rainbows. I love rainbows. Rainbows are awesome because I just love colors. Um. Get around them that way. Haha! -ha. Wee! Hi, Mario. Bye, Mario. Hi, bye. Kiss my ass. Ha 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 ha! And the boom shakalaka, we did it. He fell over! Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> do 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 do! Bow! Do you really want more? Screaming up louder. What is that in my head? I don't know. Parade! We've seen the parade every single time, which is kind of impressive. Because um, if there is nobody in the path, if there is nobody in the path, the parade will not happen. So the fact that we have seen the parade every single time is crazy. Hello, Deltora! Hello, hello, welcome in. Hope you're having a good day. It's always those two. <laughs> I mean, I got stuck in the parade once and lost all my money, but... That was once upon a time ago. 
Once upon a time, do 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 do. Oh, here comes the sun, do 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 do. Again, this is just Tessa Jane the musical, which is perfectly fine. We're. How many battle mini games are we gonna get today? Jeez! At this rate, I'm not gonna finish in time to pick up my daughter from school. Day the races. Ouch! <laughs> I like hit my controller right on my ankle. Right on my bone, and that was not great. <sighs> now what's gonna happen here? No! No! My safety boo! No! Oh, I'm so sad now. No school, only Mario. <laughs> yes, no school, only Mario. I don't know why. I have a suspicion as to why my daughter does not have her after school program today. Um, but yeah, Boo has won every single time. Mario, you fucking cheat. There, I said it, I dropped a F bomb. Cause the safety Boo, Boo has won every single time this go around in my prey too. Yeah, um, yeah, my daughter doesn't have an after school program today so I have to be done by 345 at least. So, hence why Mario Party Day, when it was supposed to be Xenoblade 2. Um, but I'll do that tomorrow. I was also really sad. <laughs> I was also really sad and, and wanted to not be sad. So here I am playing Mario Party. So I don't have to use much brain power. I have what, mushroom? What's a mushroom gonna do for me? I mean, I ain't gonna roll much better with two dice blocks as opposed to one, so... Might as well, right? Twelve? They're nothing. It's over... It's over ten. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine... Uh, stars what? Top right. Mario is close. How much money does he have? He has 25. Where? Oh, he landed on the battle space up there. That's... Mm, he's probably gonna end up getting that. So, I'll go down, actually. I'll take the hit by Baby Bowser, but also I will just get the money back from the bank, so it works out pretty good. Wee. This way. I want to go this way. This way. Hooray. So I just wanted something to shut my brain off because comfort. My emotional support Bowser is here, okay? <laughs> we love our emotional support Bowser here. Yeah, it was up till 2 a.m. Last night, because uh, my husband needed to, to wake up at 2 to, to get to work, to get to where he needs to go on time, because he drives a truck. Semi-truck. So that's what he does. Um, used to, he'd be home every night, but, again, with the changes, um, it's not going to be the case anymore. He'll just be home on weekends, so there is that. Ah, like, I haven't really said too much as to what exactly went down, but like, it's not really my place to really say anything about it. I just know some changes are going. I'm getting settled into a new normal, quote unquote. Ah! I uh, did a short hop when I uh, didn't need to. <laughs> my bad. Sorry, I scared everyone with my scream. Sorry. <laughs> oh, that scared me, even. If you really want more, scream it out louder. Okay, um. Huh. Yeah, sometimes it's kind of hard to, to keep my brain occupied when there's like nothing going on in the world. Ha 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 
You lost everything, Mario! Now you must suffer the consequences! What do you have? Uh, no, I'm not gonna- nope, 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 we're not gonna buy anything. Hello! Steal a star! Uh, <laughs> anyway. Hello, Iggy! Hello, hello, welcome in! Hope you're having a good day! How are we doing today? I'm doing pretty good! Just stole a star from Mario, and I'm living the dream. That's Midwest code for help! Anyway, <laughs> no, I'm, I'm doing okay. I'm doing good. Uh, just playing some Mario Party, cause I love Mario Party. I love playing Mario Party. It's my favorite. Ah! Again, I have nothing against rainbows. I love rainbows, cause I love colors. I don't like this reskinned mini game. It's so dumb. I avoided it last time. Ugh. <laughs> ah. Cause uh, you unlock this by buying all the minigames, essentially. Um, and to do that, you have to clear minigame coaster on normal and hard to be able to buy all the minigames. And once you do, you go to play them, and Piranha Plant's like, Hey, you purchased all these minigames! Here's a bonus minigame! And he'll do that twice. Um, one for a uh, Dungeon Dash, and the other for Rainbow Run. Dungeon Dash is essentially Desert Dash from Mario Party 1, just reskinned. Rainbow Run is Tightrope Treachery, reskinned. No! No! I might have freaked out my postman. Because I I saw a shadow approaching the door and I heard a thing and then I like screamed <laughs> I may have scared off my postman or postwoman. I don't know who it is. Sometimes it's a woman. Sometimes it's a man um, I don't see them so I don't know, but I think I freaked them out <laughs> Whoever it was I think I freaked them out Oh well. <laughs> oh well. I mean, I do stream during the daytime. There's no one really here during the daytime. And I do get very, very loud when I stream and just play games in general. So I think that <laughs> that's something. Uh, probably gonna have to say no to this. It's going that way. Yeah, we're gonna decline. Step right up. This is like my third time being here. Hooray. Um, but yeah, if I just need a nice game to shut off my brain, you know what? This is fine because I'm the only one with coins, essentially. Just take everything, Luigi. Just take everything. 28! Oh! He left me two coins. He left me two whole coins. I appreciate that, Luigi. <laughs> he didn't take everything from me. He just took enough. Hexagon Heat. Yeah, My Prey is a good game for me to just shut my brain off for a little bit and just kind of have fun, you know? The impulsiveness, I guess. Um, like the impulsiveness of um, my Aries moon, if you will. Because talking about astrology earlier. <laughs> Yellow! Blue. Oh no, Luigi. <laughs> anyway. I did it. I defeated Mario. Ow. Hit my ankle again. 
<laughs> I keep smashing my controller on my ankle. I need to stop. <laughs> I need to stop. It really hurts when I do that. But it's just when I sit on the floor, I'm like constantly adjusting myself because if I sit like cross-legged for too long, one of my legs goes numb and I have to readjust constantly. And my ankles are always exposed as it happens. So, yeah, my ankles are always exposed and I'm always flailing my controller around like nobody's business and I'm smacking my ankles with it. <laughs> and here I am once again. I'm going in circles. Uh, run around in circles, run around in circles, run around in circles. Oh, that's running around in circles for sure. Uh, what's it? 145 almost. Um, but yeah, staying up till two. It, it, there's really nothing much to to really do in those hours. Cause I try to, you know, keep my brain occupied. Um, no one was really like live long enough to help me through the um. Help me through, you know, like the the later hours. So I, I found a, a stream VOD of someone I had um, recently discovered, and like I just love the vibes, you know. So I just I just had that on. So run around in circles, run around in circles. Perfect strategy. Uh, so in Bowser Land, if you have insufficient funds to pay interest when landing on the Bowser Bank space, will the remaining interest carry over to the player who paid? It resets to zero. The bank resets to zero. Uh, because that's happened a few times already today. So yeah, it just resets to zero. Um, but uh, also this has happened before on stream a long time ago. Um, if you don't have enough. And it's like a huge amount that you have to pay back. If you don't have enough and you have a star, the bank can take your star. It was a crazy moment to witness. I can't tell you which exact stream it was. I played on Bowser Land quite a bit. Um, but it did happen on stream and I believe I was flabbergasted and I am never leaving this place. Heard about that before, it's brutal. It didn't happen to me. It happened to one of the computers. But it was crazy to witness. I had no idea that could happen. So it was like a first time I would never heard of this. So it's crazy. But yeah, I think it just depends on the um, the deficit of the, your, the coins in your pocket and how much the loan is. I think that all depends on that too. And whether or not you have a star. Because, um... Uh, cause I had to land on the bank. And I had like 20 something on like a 40 coin loan. So I just had to pay everything. And it just reset, so. Oh, come on. Oh, nice. Ha 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 ha. I juked you! I juked you! Ha 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 ha. Hooray. Wario is not the sharpshooter. He is not. Well, at least Archer, anyway. Like a sniper. I don't even foresee Wario being like a sniper. I more or less see him as, you know, upfront melee guy, you know? Hello, Gogeta. Hello, hello. Welcome in. Hope you're having a good day. And hello, Sifu. Hello, hello. Welcome in. Hope you're having a good day. And thank you for the lurk. I would assume you're teaching, because that's usually the case, so I, I wish you luck with that. Oh, we get a dough I missed from Wario. And no money at all, period. Love it, because he didn't have any to begin with. Wario was overcome by the urge to jump the pipe, or suddenly overcome by the urge. Oh, it's not going to matter if he doesn't have enough to steal coins. 
it's whatever. Oh, now you- oh, you got money now, okay. I wasn't aware Mario had money. <laughs> I mean, he's got the creative control, but not the- not money. Love me like money, love me like cars, love me babe, love me babe, wherever you are. Again, I'm just singing everything today. I'm singing in the rain, just singing in the rain. Say his name and he appears! Nope. That was not Joe Henry's moment. It was not Joe Henry's moment. <laughs> it's... is it... I get to do this again! Hooray! I got nothing to lose! Again, I am probably gonna clip my nails sometime this week, because they're like barely longer than my fingertips. The only thing about it is I can... That's like the only satisfying thing about having long nails is doing that. Because, like, to me, that's satisfying. But, like, anything else is just a pain in the butt. And I also painted them because I don't paint my nails very often. And I... I always end up... Um, peeling off my nail polish. <laughs> so I'm, I'm doing my best. Because I, I get super obsessive. Um, when, like, something has, like, a chip in it, I'm, like, peeling it off. And I repaint it. I've repainted a few nails here and there because the chips were just so bad. But for the most part, I've left them mostly alone because I've redone one, two, four, five nails probably. It's just, it's an entire hand, but <laughs> it's an entire hand, but uh, it's not all of them all at once, so. My toenails that I paint, I usually leave alone. Because I don't think about it, even though a lot of the time I, when I sit in my chair, because yes, I do have a chair contrary to popular belief. Um, when I sit in my chair, my feet are usually like pretty close to my face. <laughs> Funny enough, because uh, I, I say as I'm demonstrating right now and nobody can see it, I'm going to do my best to describe it. Like when I sit, I kind of do a slouchy slouch. And I like cross my legs and my knee, my left knee is propped up, left or right, doesn't matter, um, is propped up and my other leg, my ankle is essentially like right below my knee, kind of propped up, so, and I sit kind of crunched in, so there is like less than a foot distance between my foot and my face. <laughs> so that's just a kind of, um, demonstrate that if, when I'm sitting in my chair so yeah so I do have a chair and I sit like a gremlin right a up <coughs> excuse me right a up up right a up up two three four five six seven eight a up a up B B, A, left. A up B. A up B, B up. What? Did I just hit it too? I think I just hit it too early. Yeah, I think I just hit the button too early. Thankfully, Luigi is our breakdance master and won the game for us. So thank you, Luigi. Thank you for covering my mistakes. Because it was up left, wasn't it? The last two were, uh, it was like, you know, left A, B, B, up left, I think. I know the last one was left, and I think I just hit it too early. Oh, well, it's fine. We won him in the game. I should not hang on to it, because I have a bad habit of just hanging on to stuff that doesn't matter anymore, and that's why I was sad. But anyway, neutral. That canceled out. <laughs> I, I get a loan from the bank and immediately have to pay it back to Baby Bowser. That's just how money works. You you acquire money and then you have to spend it right away because that's just how it works in the world.
Yeah, the only thing satisfying or like quote unquote nice about having long nails is I know that's like ASMR territory, but like doing that and like tapping on things is so satisfying to me. It is absolutely satisfying to me. So <laughs> So sorry for like the abrupt ASMR, sorry. I just wanted to, to demonstrate that before I like lose my train of thought. B. A. B again. Huh. Yeah, today's just been kind of a day. We got Monday Night Raw tonight. Um, kind of excited because we have Sammy Gunther. It's not Sammy Gunther. Sammy Chad Gable, um, for the IC title tonight. That's gonna be really fun. And Seamus is supposed to be coming back tonight. That's awesome. Um, and I'm super excited for Liv and Rhea, because that's building. I, because I like Liv. I like Liv Morgan. I also really love Rhea Ripley. Rhea Ripley is awesome. She is a fucking star. I love her. Um, but I also love Liv Morgan. Um, so I think she's really cool. I think she's underrated. And she's really proven herself over the last couple of years, so. Insufficient funds! Mario landed on that earlier, so there really wasn't much. Yeah, I, I might do a little bit of digging, because I do have all of my stream VODs in uh, convenient playlists on my uh, YouTube page. Um, so all of my Mario Party 2 stream VODs are all in one playlist, and I can just kind of um, look through... Um, I can just look through and see which stream VOD it was. And to see that. Let's start with the bank, you have zero coins. Okay. That makes sense. That makes sense. I could just, just trying to rack my brain because I'd seen it one time. I think I might have seen it twice. I just remember the first time I ever saw that, I was freaking out because I'm like, I had no idea that could happen. Um... There's this uh, group of people, um, they played a lot of Mario Party, and uh, I was um, looking through their uh, clips one day, and uh, I was looking through like funny moments that they had that were clipped, and uh, there was one moment where in Mario Party 3, it makes total sense for this to happen, but like it's just, it doesn't happen very often because of the circumstances allowing it. And I would imagine it's the same for Mario Party 2 and any other uh, Mario Party that has a battle space on it. Um, there will not be a battle initiated if all of the players have less than 10 coins. Because I saw this clip of these guys playing Mario Party uh, 3. And... Um, someone had landed on a battle space and, but all of them had less than 10 coins. I think the most someone had was eight and the dialogue, they kind of skipped the dialogue real fast, but like they realized like, oh, we can't do a battle mini game. No one has enough for 10. <laughs> so, which was kind of crazy. Um, but yeah, just some, some rarities in in Mario Party is, is kind of wild because I know the Bowser suit exists in Mario Party 4. I have never seen it in action. I have seen it in videos and it never even got used in, um, shoot, crap. Why am I so bad at this? Um, I just never seen it like in action until like I saw it in videos. Like, I didn't even know the Bowser suit even existed in Mario Party 4. It's so rare. 
All right, after this bobsled run, we are going to take our break. Because um, it's a little stuffy in here. Um, I can tell because my nose. <laughs> I mash as fast as I can, and it's still never enough. Um, also, it's it's a little stuffy in here, so I'm gonna turn on the air a to blah, blah, blah. turn on the AC, and um, you know, take our break as well, because it's also tato time. Okay. Uh, then shoot. I missed it. The AI, the hard AI partner will not let me hit that boost. I, I don't know what it is. Um, because when I did my haha -ha April Fools, um, I had all easy AI. Um, I hit the boost easily. So I don't know what it is about the hard AI, but they will not let me hit that boost on that path. I don't know what it is. But yeah, the easy AI let me hit it pretty easy. But, uh, yeah. Uh, it's hard to believe that after you win this game, we're going back to square one, Marfa 3. Yep. Yep, we are. Because we are running the gauntlet. 50 turns on everything. The only quote-unquote exception is if my Mario Party 5 disc will cooperate. Oh, we have a Bowser Parade. We're going to wait till the parade's over. Oh my god, the parade has... The parade has gone off every time! Am I in this? No, I shouldn't be. I should not be in this. I mean, Mario Party 3 is my favorite, so... But it was kind of nice to take a break from it. But I've also haven't played 4, 6, and 7, and 8 in like a year. So, that's going to be fun. Alright. We will never know what number he got. <laughs> we will never know. Uh, so we're going to take our break. We are going to get up, stretch, go to the bathroom, grab a snack. Do whatever it is you need to do, and we'll be right back. Showing off, don't wanna have to wait tonight, wait tonight. Better off, I'm gonna find my way tonight, wait tonight. To me, I wanna heal your sorrow. Won't you talk to me? We'll make a new tomorrow. Won't you talk to me?
there's no one else who loves me like you used to some days i'm not myself there's no one i can turn to and i know all the feelings that we share are in the past mm -hmm. and i know your relationships are never meant to last Alrighty, we are back, and we are champion. Let's see if that keeps up. All right, and um, can confirm. I'm pretty sure it was the male person who I probably scared as I yelled and they showed up. Uh, we did get a couple packages. Um, I'd forgotten about it until I saw them. Um, my mother-in-law ordered some some clothes for the kiddos. So, 
And uh, I think some of those showed up today. I don't know if it's everything. It might be. I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, clothes for the kiddo showed up. Uh, I am not landing on that. I don't know how much is in there. I am not landing on that. I don't care. I do not care. I'm not landing on that. <laughs> uh, I don't have to be the one, do I? No, I get to... We. I get to, 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 to blow them up. Uh, but yeah. Guys, it's springtime. We're getting into summer as well. And uh, kiddos don't really have much summer clothes that fit them properly. Because my oldest has shorts. But like... And it's like, I don't know like exactly the dress code off the top of my head. But like, I know when I was in school, shorts had to be fingertip length and the one that she has I mean they cover her yes but they are not fingertip length so I'm like eh, probably ought to wait till we get you shorts that are long enough for you to wear so that way you're not like sweating in jeans like yes your dad wears jeans and a t-shirt year round but like that is your dad he's also working all the time too so he's got to cover his legs but granted, there was one time when it was only like, we only were dating for like a couple of months and his um, brother-in-law uh, ran a tree service. And so, you know, got in contact with, um, with them to, um, nice. Uh, got in contact with them to like do my parents' trees at their house. And he was working for them at the time. And uh, he was trying to, I think, start a chainsaw something with a chainsaw and damn near hacked off his leg. <laughs> um, he only, luckily he only caught his jeans. There was like a big old tear in the jeans, but his body completely unharmed. <laughs> so there is that instance. Um, he, um, uh, uh, Back in 2015, he wrecked a truck. That one wasn't his fault. Um, because someone hit him in an intersection where there was no stop sign. Um. Um, but lay the truck over and I think laid over, pop back up, or like rolled or something. He came out of that one relatively unscathed. I mean, he was pretty scratched up and, and bruised up, but like he went back to work in just a few days after that for, for whatever that's worth. Um, he walked out of that one and um, the wreck he was in um, a few weeks ago walked out of just fine. Still kind of hurting a little bit because you know, he's a little older, not as young as he used to be. Oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. Um, but yeah, he came out of that one again relatively unharmed. Nothing broken. Uh, so after those three instances, um, I have said to him, So, what's it like being God's favorite? <laughs> Cause there's no way in hell any other person would have like survived those relatively unharmed. So my husband is God's favorite, apparently. <laughs> How are you? I'm doing uh, pretty good right now. Just sitting, playing some Mario Party, having a good time. Huh? Get a drink right here. <coughs> but I had some go down the wrong pipe. Those moments suck. Uh... I'm gonna decline that actually. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Fart. <laughs> Fart. <laughs> I had a feeling. Happening or happening? You know, I would honestly like an item. What are you gonna force me to buy? A mushroom for 12 coins? You know what? I'll take it. All right, and Peachy was suddenly overcome by the urge to jump into the pipe. I'm over there anyway. Maybe I should have gone over there. 
Maybe I should have gone over there. Oh well, too late now. Oh, it was only in like a 10 coin loan. I probably would have been fine if I went down there. A three year anniversary stream today. Oh, let's go. Happy anniversary. Awesome, awesome, let's go. That's awesome, three years, that's a long time. I know three years is a long time because my, my, my youngest is three, so three years goes by pretty quick. Uh, my stream anniversary is not until August. I don't even know what I'm gonna be doing because it, it, it lands on a Mario Party day. Uh, my birthday lands on a Mario Party day again because leap year happened. So we skipped a day. Because these two days were on Tuesday uh, last year. And now they're both on Thursday this year. I've won this once as the one. And I think that was on uh, Thursday, actually. Oh, uh, yeah, my birthday's on a Thursday this year. And my stream anniversary is on a Thursday this year. I'm pretty sure, anyway. Uh, and they land on Mario Party days. So, I don't even know what I'm gonna do when it comes to there. Um, I don't even know about my affiliate anniversary either, because I know that's not till December. So. More of these! Let it end! Give me, like, Crazy Cutter or something. We haven't had that one yet. I know we've had, like, every other one except for Crazy Cutter. It's not even on there! We've had all of these other ones. Where the hell is Crazy Cutter? Maybe Mario knows I can beat him at Crazy Cutter and he's like, nah fam, we're not doing this. I know people love to just hang on to the bomb until it's like ready to blow. I am so bad at doing that. I am extremely bad at doing that. Like, I can never figure out the timing properly, and I end up blowing myself up in the process, because I'm either, I, I go too early, or I'm too late and I blow myself up. So, I know that's a, that's a strat people do. I am, I'm too much of a chicken. <laughs> I am too much of a chicken to do that. But I did though. But I usually just kind of mash the buttons. Like, hop a bomb in Mario Party 1. Um, you just have to press A, and I'm usually just mashing it <laughs> to get it away from me. I'm gonna stream uh, FIFA or Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. Ooh, Kakarot? Kakarot's really good. Uh, Kakarot is, is really good. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. I can kind of get back over there if I get a good roll with my mushroom. Yeah, Kakarot's really good. Um, that's like the only game my husband has um, bought um, twice. Uh, or no, not twice, three times, cause uh, he bought the Switch version. Uh, he had pre-ordered the Switch version. And, uh... He didn't want to wait for it to be delivered, so he bought it digitally. <laughs> he bought it digitally, so we have both digital and the physical of Kakarot on the Switch. And then when we got our PS5, um, he found the PS5 version of Kakarot and downloaded that. And, and bought that. So he has bought Kakarot three times. And I will say... Uh, Dragon Ball Z Kakarot, um, it runs the best on the PS5 because the load times on the Switch are not the greatest. And uh, there's like a funny little, uh, a funny little like glitch you can do. It, it's it's so funny because, um, um, you know, there's, there's the transformations. What's happening right now? Um, yeah, there's the transformations like Super Saiyan. Um, you, if you time it right. Oh, I didn't know where that was going. They just agreed to draw. Wow, rude. Um, if you time it right, you can stay transformed, um, in the overworld. 
like you can transform into like the Super Saiyan, Super Saiyan 2, uh, Super Saiyan 3, um, God, or like Blue, all the transformations. And um, it's so funny with Goku, this is the only character it does this with. <laughs> when you go fishing, when you are in a transformation you are not supposed to be in. It doesn't do it with Super Saiyan. Regular Super Saiyan, I don't think. Because there is a part of the game where you are Super Saiyan in the overworld. And that's like between like the week of like training for like cell games and stuff. Um, there is, when you go fishing, in a transformation you are not supposed to be in, um, Goku's eyes bug the fuck out. <laughs> Like, they are just so abnormally huge. Like, I don't understand. It's so funny. Like, anytime he, like, gets the gets the transformation into the overworld, the, the first thing that we do is, is go fishing. That's the first thing that he does. And uh, it only does it with Goku. Goku is the only one it does this for. And, like, his eyes are just so big and it's almost like creepy in a way especially uh super saiyan 3 super saiyan 3 goku going fishing oh like that like that's the stuff of nightmares <laughs> that's the stuff of nightmares uh especially have all the dlcs yes we did too but yeah super saiyan 3 Bug-eyed Goku. No, nightmare fuel. <laughs> nightmare fuel. And I think to, to do it, um, you need to uh, transform like right as the battle is ending. So you need like your, your assist partners in battle to KO the enemies, I think. And you have to hit have to transform at like just the right frame to get it to work. Uh, you empty? Are you done? Are you done? Like it, it is kind of fun to um uh go fly in the overworld as a transformation you were not supposed to be in, like like blue or god, you know. I'm still in here, running around in circles. This is fine. Can those numbers be flipped? Can the four and the three be flipped, please? So then I can have one, four, three. I had it kind of once and then Mario took it away from me. <laughs> Mario took it away from me and I, I don't like him for it. Which is perfectly fine because I don't like Mario for a lot of things. Oh, I'm the dance master. <gasps> okay, Riley wants A. A up, left, down. Oh, Mario! Whoa, that toe touch! Better than I could ever do. Five, six, seven, eight. Just leave that last one blank. See what they do with it. I think on a blank one, you have to leave it alone. Three copies too? Nice. Nice. And we have like a, a fancy little little case for, for one with the pre-order bonus that we got. So it's pretty cool. No, last ten turns. Ten turns. Oh, he's right there. Again! Really? With the power move? I'm getting deja vu! Deja vu. I have seen this play before. He is rolling higher than a 10. I don't even know where I was going with that. I don't know. Please be in the merry-go-round. Please be in the merry go round. It hasn't been in the merry-go-round in a long time. It's been on every other star space except for the merry-go-round. I want it to be on the merry-go-round so bad. Because then I can get it. And I would love it. But now he can just two stars, one turn it. It's like he knew. This is the exact layout that he got the last time. Go the other way. Damn it. Yep. Yep. What 
do I keep getting attracted? Jessica Chikulyoga. That could have been me. That could have been me, but no. Megaron! Yeah! <laughs> yeah! Ow! Ah, oh, I like smashed my toe into the floor. Ow! <laughs> a baby Bowser. A baby Bowser. It's a baby. Ouch. Again, I need to stop. Ha 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 I need to do it's like the game keeps me in here to protect me because damn near any time the Bowser parade has gone off I have been in that merry-go-round that's insane to me Oh, like the funniest thing on this board is if someone gets the Bowser bomb and baby Bowser is in the merry round He just goes around in circles and I love it. It's great It's great Bam bam Ba na na down Bam bam Ba na na down Goomba, that's right Oh, there's Crazy Cutter. It's not even there. We don't get Crazy Cutter? Rude I want Crazy Cutter. I want Crazy Cutter. We haven't seen it. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right, we gotta give him... Okay. Yeah, this one's a little bit more precise than the first one was. Nose goes down a little bit. I think that's good. Finish. Of course it's good. It's a hundred points. Let's go. Kid, at least not there. Blue, 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 blue. All right, let's go. We toad have bottom jeans, toads with the fur. The whole club looking at her. She hit the floor, she hit the floor. Next thing you know, she had to go low, low. Oh, shit. Nope. Buddy. Fine, we do it the convoluted way. <laughs> Cause it's not me if I'm not doing it the convoluted way. <laughs> anyway. Anyway. I feel like Bowser Land is the only board where the save screen is just all black. I feel like the other ones have the character portraits on them. I wonder if it's because of the parade. I think it's because of the parade. I need to gain like five coins. <laughs> I need to gain five coins because then I will have one, four, three and I can keep that stray kids tag relevant even though I talked about them in abundance and even listed off their birthdays earlier. <laughs> Still have to keep that stray kids tag relevant. I don't have the physical copy of it, but when I get the PS5, it glitched out um, when Future Trunks came out. Uh, so I waited for Christmas to get it digitally for the PS4 version, and when it came out on PS5, I got the digital version for the PS5 for free. Nice! Yes! Yes! Nice! PS5. One, four, three, Stray Kids! Why do I keep getting attracted? Jessica Chikulyaga. I cannot explain this reaction. Eco bucket one for three. Aww. I haven't really listened to that song in a while. I just get that in my head from time to time. La 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 la. Just feel the rock. Again, Rainbow Run again. Are you done? Are you done? 
All right, I'll be right back. Sorry about that. Um, I really did not want to play Rainbow Run again. <laughs> and I figured, oh, I can just put away Riley's stuff. And that's what I did. Um, mm, I have three moves left. I'm gonna hit that. Uh, I mean, uh, No. Two turns left. This is fine. This is fine. Everything is fine. Is it though? I don't know. I don't know. But it's okay. We'll make it fine. It's okay to not be fine. Gensha chi anado gensha na. Ah, oh, mega marathon. That was a part of a song from my daughter's favorite song. I remember to breathe this time. Is Vegeta excited for Sparking Zero? Yes. Absolutely he is. Like, probably the moment it is available for pre-order, he's pre-ordering it. He is, like, super excited. Because it's been a game that a lot of Dragon Ball... Like, the fans of the... Wow! I got the same distance as Mario? That's bullshit. <laughs> um, I don't want to be associated with Mario. Oh. Um, uh, but yeah, it's a, it's a game that the fans of, like, the Dragon Ball video games have been looking forward to for a long time. So... Uh, yeah, he's been looking forward to it for a long time, because he loves... I know he really likes Budokai Tenkaichi 3. I know he says that one's the best one. Wow. Mm-hmm. Uh, so yeah, he's he's looking forward to, to it. So, it's exciting. There's gonna be, like, a lot of characters for it, too. So, 
and like seeing him be super excited for it, it's like getting me super excited for it. Cause I, like I've watched him play all the Dragon Ball games because he is a big Dragon Ball guy. Um, oh, you're on behalf of Bowser. Thank you. Oh, 144. Oh, come on. I think the Bowser parade is going down. So I think I am perfectly fine. Luigi's in the pathway, so it's gonna go off no matter what. We have had a Bowser parade every five turns. That's insane to me. Because I have had times where it's never gone off at all because no one's been in the path. So, excited for never played them. Oh man, it, it should be pretty good. It should be really good. Because I know a lot of people really like um, Budokai, Tenkaichi 2 and 3. Because I know 3 is, like, the best one. At least, you know, that's what Majito says. Because, like, I don't know what, you know, the people of the internet say about it. I just know what Vegito says about it. Clean up. Oh, come on. Come on. <gasps> yes! He got greedy! He got greedy! <laughs> That's what you get for not believing in Joe Hendry! <laughs> Say his name and he appears. I believe in Joe Hendry. I believe in Joe Hendry. Wow, I lost it there for a second. I lost it. But I got it back. I don't know. I got a little like that. Pink, pink, but I'm gonna get you. Frankenstein. 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 Hello, Johnny. Hello, hello. Welcome in. Hope you're having a good day. Oh, I didn't even realize he was right there. Okay. And clean your mouth. Oh, he had like four stars, 15. He had 415. That was today's date for a second. And now he has 515. <laughs> ah! Bowser is here too. Okay. Baby Bowser cried. And baby Bowser cried? Is that what you think? Did he cry? No, I think he's just happy Baby Bowser's right there, kid. I think he's just happy. Hello, hope you're having a good afternoon. It's been, yeah, it's been a pretty good afternoon. Been playing lots of Mario Party. You know, the works. Uh, 20 coins and the, oh, it's right, oh, hi, hello. I'll take that, thank you very much. I believe in Joe Hendry. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. We are in the merry-go-round once again. There it is once again. Oh, I didn't quite hit the happening. Knowing my luck, I probably will. I don't know. Uh, I haven't won the Bowser slots yet. I have not won yet. Uh... I did it! Look at me go. I'm being rewarded for believing in Joe Hendry. Because <laughs> again, for whatever reason, Joe Hendry has gotten... Uh, like, it's, it's gone viral in the, uh... In the internet wrestling community. The IWC, if you will. <laughs> for whatever reason. I mean, the the his theme is so catchy. This theme is so catchy. That Kelly Clarkson song took me back. Here I am, once again. I'm torn in the pieces. Yeah, that's all I... Yeah, I, what was it? Behind These Hazel Eyes, I think is what the song's called. But yeah. I mean, Kelly Clarkson is like... Stop. Is a goat, man. She's, she's, she's the boss. The OG American Idol winner. Oh, come on. You're not gonna let me have my boom shakalaka moment? Yeah! 
Boom shakalaka, boom shakalaka, boom shakalaka. Dance, 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 dance. Anyway. <gasps> anyway. Oh, hey, here we are. Last five turns. Let's go. Peach is first. Wario is second. Mario is third. And Luigi is in last place. Uh, superstar. Superstar. Um, Bowser predict? Yes, Bowser will predict. Uh, the loser will be Luigi. He gets a 10 coin bonus for being the loser. You know what? That's fine. That's fine. <clears throat> Standard last five turns procedures all red and blue spaces are doubled and if you land on the same space as your opponent You get to duel them Hello die creature. Hello. Hello. Welcome in. Hope you're having a good day All right last five turns here we go Used to watch all the American Idol shows my mom and my sister watched them like religiously up to a certain point i think um the season that i kind of stopped paying attention to it quote unquote was probably the season where adam lambert got robbed <laughs> adam lambert should have won his season but look at him now adam lambert's amazing he's great I been mean, okay and yourself i've been pretty good today you know, essentially, uh, today was supposed to be Xenoblade Chronicles 2, but, um, I just wanted a comfort game today, and my comfort game is Mario Party. So there we go. Uh, yes, Kelly Clarkson won the first season of American Idol. Yep, that is true. Um, jump. happy to hear. Yeah. Jump. Yeah. Jump. 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 Oh, is Riley gonna jump now? Because in Mario Party 3, TikTok hop. She she jumped with the characters. Oh, she's doing it now. Yep. <laughs> it's so cute. Uh, Riley's my three-year-old. If uh, for those who don't know. Oh, oh, about about died. E jump, jump. All right. And jump. And jump. We. And jump. And jump. So far, so good. Um, are we gonna? Uh -uh, a la the Dang and Rampa song. Turn up the heat. Okay, <laughs> I couldn't do it for very long, but that's probably like my favorite song from Danganronpa is Turn Up the Heat. It's uh, one of the songs that plays during the um, shoot, the trials. There you go. That's like one of my favorites. Unless you ever watched all the early seasons of 2005 for the nostalgia, nice. Oh, there you go. <laughs> uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. My odds are good. Let's do it. I was like, how long can you keep it up? I mean, I took a breath here and there, but uh, it goes pretty high. It does go pretty high. Wow. Bruh. Bruh. Need three dice blocks to roll a ten? What a loser. What a loser. Um. Dun 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 Okay. Um. Three turns left. One, two, three, four. I, I, for a star, I have to go this way. I have to go that way. Say, oh, I was hoping for a star. I was gonna make a big deal out of Joe Hendry again. This is just the Joe Hendry stream, apparently. Cause that's, that's just stuck in my head. 
all day. Say his name and he appears. I believe in Joe Hendry. I believe in Joe Hendry. Can you dance? Do 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 Oh, it's so good. His name is so good. Blue, blue, blue. <laughs> oh, oh well. I mean, I'll take the money. I'll take the money. I'm not gonna say no to free money. I mean, what do you take me for? I mean, there was. <laughs> ping, ping, what I get you, maniac. Frankenstein, Chung, what a maniac, maniac. Ha ha. I do kind of wish the, the, the clip had that last little ha ha. I think it's Changbin that does that. Maybe. Um, but yeah, it's, it's great. Oh, so he gets the star and I don't. Bullshit, bullshit, bullshit. <laughs> Mark Henry, three, six, mafia. Somebody gonna get their ass kicked. Yeah. Anytime I hear 3 6 Mafia, you immediately know Mark Henry, world's strongest man. Star? Star. Oh no, he lost money. Yeah. Those, those dang yeah. loans. Yeah. They'll get you every time. Yeah, I was fortunate enough to um, not need student loans because I had scholarships for the two years I went to college. Oh, shit, shit, shit. No, 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 get out! Ah, Luigi! <gasps> Do you see that? He murdered me in cold blood. You know, Luigi, if you were going to murder me like that in cold blood, at least win the mini game. Emotional damage! <laughs> Damn. There's our question of the day. Uh, what's your comfort game? This is mine. After I uh, reprimanded Luigi. <laughs> Damn. If this is my comfort, man. Four turns. Four turns? No, there's like two left. There's two turns left, child. Say his name and he. Oh. Well, uh, no matter what I do, I cannot get this one. This is fine. Emotional damage. Fuzzy. Look at your fuzzy. Well, you know what? Maybe this will work out. Well, like, the star can't be there because it was literally just there, so it can't do that. So this is fine. This is fine. Yeah, I mean, I love to torture myself. Oddly enough, Mario's magic lamp that he just bought was the first magic lamp in play, two turns from being done. Oh. Oh? Oh. <laughs> oh, 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 it's Bowser! You know. I cannot believe it. Oh, it's Bowser. It's Bowser. It's Bowser. Yowza, Bowser. Mario and Luigi. Mario and Luigi. We. Yeah, there's really no. What? What's happening? I feel like something is a little weird with my ZL button, because sometimes it doesn't want to work. Uh, pretty Pokemon Snap, Pokemon Yellow, uh, Mario Sunshine, nice, nice. Sunshine, uh, I have played, but my disc was scratched up. Well, at least the first one that I got was like all scratched up and stuff. Um, I never got past Rico Harbor. <laughs> oh no, I'm in the way! Oh no! Luigi, how could you? You did this to both of us! Luigi, you did this to both of us! How could you? How could you do this? 
At least I have all the- at least I have money, and I will still have money after this. How much will you have, Luigi? And that was the finale! Thanks for joining us! This was the last parade of the day! Thank you very much! You're welcome! We had a parade every single time. At least one person has been in the way of the parade every time. And damn, he just lost 12 coins and got back 5. Because that just forces you to buy an item. Yes, right. Mario Sunshine. Mario Sunshine? Alright, let's see. Oh boy. Uh, yeah, I think the the Mario the 3D Mario game that I've probably played the most is probably Galaxy 1. Mario Galaxy 1 is probably the 3D Mario game that I have played the most. Because I have technically beaten it. I have technically beaten it, but just the way it works. To even like 100% it, you have to beat the final boss to get the uh, purple coin comets. Um, so, yeah. It's really weird how that works, but... um. So I know I've done purple coin comets in um, in Mario Galaxy, so that's how I know I've at least beaten the final boss. So, uh, just a few games I know, like uh, back of my hand, tend to be good comfort games. Yeah, exactly. Like, um, I mean, Mario Party. It's a game I've played for a long time, and uh, it's nice to just kind of shut my brain off for a little bit, you know, for a few hours, fifty turns, you know. Like, I didn't always play 50 turns all the time. They were usually saved for, like, special occasions, but now, because streaming, I do it all the time. Super Mario World? Nice. Mm-hmm. The Rock? What about The Rock? The Rock. You rock? We rock, we rock. Camp Rock. Oh. Oh? American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes! Oh no. Adrenaline in my soul. Every fight out of control. Do it all to get them off the feet. Crowd is here, about to blow. Waiting for me to start the show. Out the curtain lights go up, I'm home. Whoa! Riley did the thing. Riley did the thing. I love it. So cute. Yeah, there was a uh, one stream where uh, someone came in. I think it was Jared that said um, something about uh, Cody finishing the story, but like Cody's name was never mentioned. I, all I read was finish the story. Oh, that was my bad. All I read was uh, finish the story and Riley immediate like Cody Rhodes American Nightmare Cody Rhodes. I'm like dang Riley. You know what's up? You know what's up? <gasps> yeah, Mario World's a good one. It's over, kid! Alright. 181. That's a good number. Minigame star! That's right, bitches! I am the minigame queen! Coin star? Who's the richest of them all? That'd be me again. Hello? I'm the only one that even broke three digits, bitches! Don't even think about it, Riley. Don't think about it. Don't do it. Oh, and Happening Star? Um, I've won in the merry-go-round several times. So, um, yeah, I'm the true superstar here with a clean sweep of the bonus stars. Yeah, peachy. <laughs> <laughs> the hour has come! Nani? I honestly was expecting Luigi, but then I remembered- Oh wait, I was in the merry-go-round quite a bit. And it takes two happening spaces to get in and out of the merry-go-round. So, I was in it quite a bit. Just in time, Peach! I wanna go on that roller coaster. I wanna go on the roller coaster? Roller coasters. Roller coasters are fun. 
I do remember um, when I was in, I think it was eighth grade, my eighth grade year, um, our big end of the year trip was to an amusement park, um, like three hours away. But they, you know, reserved the whole park for us and it was, you know, for school field trip, whatever. Um, there was a big roller coaster and you needed to, to buy a, a, a separate ticket for it because everything was free except for like two things that you had to buy separate tickets for, which is fine. Um, this roller coaster, you, you know, it goes around once and then it comes back around and it stops and, you know, everything's all good. Well, we rode it and it came back around, but it didn't stop. So we essentially got a free ride out of that roller coaster, which was pretty fun and exciting. Yeah, Peachy's the real superstar. Yeah, Peachy. Whoa, 10 stars, 10 stars. Ah, whoa. Both Wario and Mario got 155 in mini games. Wow. That's crazy. That is crazy. Luigi was pretty close there too. If he got 20 less coins, he would have it would have been a three-way tie. That's trash, insane. Mommy. Trash, what tr you got something in your hand? Yeah, trash. Uh most 231. Yeah, look, look at that. The second most is 71. So many battle mini games. We didn't even, I think we saw every battle mini game except for Crazy Cutter. <gasps> And I was begging for it right at the end. Um, 13. Oh, War well, Luigi wasn't even close. It was Wario. Dang. All right, I'll take it. No chance times, though. That is impressive. No chance times. We had one Bowser chance time, and I gave my money to Bowser. That's essentially what happened. Uh, battle. Let's see. Three, seven, 11, 11 battle mini games. Of course, Mario landed on the most with his creative control. Um, items. Oh, if Mario landed on one more bank, it would have been one, two, three, four. One bank. One yep, bank. I had one bank, which on this board, it's a good thing. Yeah, that, that's crazy to me. 231, and the next highest is 71. I was the only one that broke triple digits. Crazy. Crazy. Um, but in the end, that will be it. And this wraps it up for Mario Party 2 Gauntlet Run. My Party 2. Uh, so... Uh, let's wait till we get back into the menu here. Or like the main menu. 1,200 coins for that. I have a lot of money. Wish I can get this much money in Marpe 1. But nope, it's hard to get a lot of money in Marpe 1. Yeah. All right, we are back here. All right, so that'll be it for today. Uh, schedule for the week. Um. You know, I called the Audible. Today was Mario Party. Uh, tomorrow, we should be hopefully returning to Xenoblade Chronicles 2. And it's like the quote-unquote beach episode. But I only have one swimsuit, so it's going to be fine. Uh, we're just going to do some side questing and stuff to kind of get back into the swing of things with Xenoblade Chronicles 2. Um, and then Wednesday, we return to Paper Mario. We're going to start Chapter 3 on Wednesday. Uh, Thursday, we are going to start Mario Party 3. Um, we're just going to start with Chili Waters, because that's a good first board to start with. I think I'm just going to go in order, because I, I went in order here. Because um, we are just, quote-unquote, running the gauntlet. Um, so, Mario Party 3 starts Thursday. That is exciting. Uh, and then Friday, we come back to Paper Mario. So, I'm just going to stall for time while the ad break goes off here. Uh, nice see you, of course. Thank you for hanging out. Oh, 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 it's magic, you know. Oh my goodness, wow, okay. Let me see. I don't think I've ever... 
raided him before. I don't think I have. Let me double check something real quick. Uh, yeah, I don't think I've ever raided Tony Toe before. He's live right now, playing Uno with with some people. Or at least, uh, someone. Yeah, he's playing Uno. Uh, but yeah, I don't think I've raided Tony before. <laughs> so we're gonna go raid Tony Toe. Tony Toe is awesome. I know he's raided me before a few times. Uh, Tony's great. His streams are a vibe. He was live at like two in the morning <laughs> last night. And I know this because I had to stay up. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna go raid Tony Toe. He's great. He's awesome. Um, uh, and as a reminder, tomorrow will be Xenoblade Chronicles 2, hopefully. Um, Wednesday is Paper Mario. Thursday is Mario Party 3. Uh, and Friday's more Paper Mario. So, typically, Mondays are Xenoblade Chronicles 2, Tuesdays and Thursdays are Mario Party, and Wednesdays and Fridays will be Paper Mario. So, thank you all for coming out hanging out, and we will see you next time. Talking to myself and I can't focus Yeah, I'm broken The door is closing Wanna be a part of something more than this I've lost control of it